channel and welcome back to another video. Today's video is going to be a little bit different. It is more of an interiors video and I am happy to say it is in collaboration with the brand Mapiful. If you have not heard of Mapiful, Mapiful before, it is a company which you can select any place in the world and have it printed up in a print for your wall. There are different sizes, there is different fonts. You can zoom in, you can zoom out and you can even do um, the starscape of what the day you were married or the day your children were born. But I chose for maps and the two maps I have chosen today are where we lived when we lived overseas. We lived in Canet on Rousselon and we also lived in the Gateshead in the UK. And it was just a sweet and lovely memory to have up on the wall. I had been looking at these for a while and Mapiful reached out to me, which I was super excited because I was really happy to get these prints, but it also meant that Chris would do a little bit of a DIY job for me, and I'm going to share that with you too. And currently, with Mapiful, you can buy two, um, two prints and get 20% off. I opted to get my own frames only so they would match my other frames down the hall, but you can get little timber um, picture frames you can get it all framed up as well so enough chatting from me I am going to take you through it and show you these gorgeous maps up close and my little mini makeover of our hallway so as you can see this is the first map which is Gateshead and it shows you the GPS location I've still got paint on my hand from a painting and I've just framed them up in the Reba frames, I believe they are, from Ikea. And I think it looks super cute. And then here is Canet on Rousselon. The reason why this is half printed is because this is the Mediterranean. We lived right on the Mediterranean here, right about here, which is so cool to have this. So if you had um, a certain day where you can um, you got married, you can have the location, the date, the time, and all that. This can all change, which I think is awesome. You can have the starscape of when your children were born or your first date. Coming down here is the wall, which I will tell you more about. So I was after a little mini makeover. This wall was always super blank. I did have the hats hanging on here for a while, but when we had this jip rocked, it got a little bit damaged and a quick fix for me. And I love paneling. I went for some easy craft paneling the cat easy craft paneling from Bunnings and they come in certain sizes so this is two cut in half um, that Chris cut in half for me and then we just popped a trim here and these hooks are also from Bunnings if you have seen Isabel's uh, Lydia's bedroom makeover you would have seen that I hung up these hooks from Bunnings and on the back of them they unscrew and so Chris took the screw out and he drilled a hole in here and then inserted them and then he just wood glued them and we let them sit for a few days so we knew it was completely solid. I looked online to find these shaker hooks everywhere here in Australia. I couldn't seem to find them so this was my best option and I think it turned out really well. I was going to make this a grey look, but I'm so happy that I went with white. Showing you what is hanging on these walls. I have this cute little rug beater. I've just tied some natural string from um, Spotlight on there. Um, but this is from a company called French and Not. Um, they have an Instagram page, which I will link below as well. But I found them actually online. And then over here, I have got just a little plant from Ikea with a macrame hanging that came from Target when I just took the pot out. And then over here, I got this gorgeous bag. I love this bag. I had it in my office, but it's so cute. I wanted it out here. And then I've just got this cute little green print. And I thought this looked 
really sweet out here especially that it's coming into summer but I also thought what was perfect with this wall is coming up from these stairs is where our swimming pool is and that way if the kids forget to hang their towels up they can easily have that I can take this off in summer and they can hang their beach towels up here so they're not lying on the floor if you have a swimming pool you know the problem <laughs> of towels on the ground and then here this floor rug um, which needs a good vacuum so and this floor needs a good clean so a cleaning video is on its way is from Bunnings and I just popped it in the front here I used to have it in front of the church pew but I think it looks really cute here it ties in the blue that I love in the home it's actually gray but it looks more navy to me and then coming along here I've got these two little baskets this is our linen cupboard here and we do have plans to pop some paneling on here but we just haven't got round to it yet we have so many projects on the go at the moment we have Isabel's room and our kitchen so this will do for now I may take these off and spray them black because they are that gold look but down here I'm going to get some pots and plant some mother-in-law's tongue in here I think it will give it some nice height but I'm yet to do that and I just moved this before to pop the tripod on so I'll just quickly squish that back so here I've just popped a couple of books, just two um, Joanna Gaines books on here and decorated it with this little vase and this candle on here, tying in the black with my gorgeous church pew. These cushions here are from H&M and then this mirror was from, this was the church pew I picked up on Gumtree and then the church, um, the mirror is off eBay it, the same people that I got my dining table and my kitchen island and they upcycle things and this is skirting from a old farmhouse here in the town that I lived in so I love that bit of history as well and you can see it's got the old hook on it as well that needs a good dust I tell you what there's a cleaning video coming and then coming along here I've just got a fiddle leaf that I picked up at Bunnings and just popped it in a little basket that I got from Kmart and this old ladder my dad gave me I've got one out in the living room as well and it's cut in half and it's an old timber ladder and this gorgeous throw if it zooms out is from Weaver and Green and all their products are made from recycled plastic bottles how cool is that here is a kitty cat it's always a kitty cat in my videos this wall I've just hung up some hats again so it can go outside this plant is not normally here I've just got him here in the Sun today Lola having a look out the window and I've just I got these hats all from Kmart and I thought they were just cute to decorate I've just got them on some command hooks that they can come off and that way if anybody's here for a swim in the pool and I forgot the hat there is a hat available and I wear these all the time so coming back along here I don't know how the lighting's gonna go but I absolutely love these maps they are so cute and they just look so good it's just changed the space completely and I absolutely love it thanks so much for watching guys I really hope you enjoyed this type of video I know it's not normally what I share here on my YouTube and I share a lot of interiors over on my Instagram which I will link on the screen now but I was so happy to have collaborated with Mapperful. they are a wonderful brand their service was amazing and long for their maps to arrive here in Australia either so if you are trying to capture a memory and you have have been looking for ideas and then definitely think about grabbing yourself a map and hanging it up on the wall I think it's a beautiful way to capture a memory and I'm just so happy with this wall it has completely transformed this space again thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video